Hey everyone, welcome back to Simply Tech Wiz. Today we're tackling a tech frustration that we've all experienced at some point slow Wi-Fi. It's the digital equivalent of hitting a traffic jam when you're trying to stream your favorite show or download a massive file. But don't worry, I've got you covered. In this video, I'm dropping some serious knowledge bombs, five genius hacks to be exact. That'll boost your Wi-Fi speed and have you surfing the web at warp speed. We're talking about simple tweaks and adjustments that can make a world of difference. So whether you're a casual internet user or a hardcore gamer who demands lightning fast speeds, these tips are for you. Stick around and let's get that Wi-Fi firing on all cylinders. All right. Let's kick things off with the foundation of a strong Wi-Fi signal router placement. Think of your router like a radio tower broadcasting its signal. You want that signal to reach every corner of your digital domain, right? First things first, avoid stashing your router away in a cabinet or behind a stack of books. Those obstacles are like kryptonite to your Wi-Fi signal. Instead, aim for a central location in your home, preferably on an elevated surface. Now, I know what you're thinking. My router is ugly. It doesn't match my decor. Look, I get it. But trust me, a little strategic placement can work wonders. Try a bookshelf, a side table, or even mount it on the wall if you're feeling ambitious. And here's a pro tip. Avoid placing your router near appliances that emit electromagnetic interference, like microwaves or cordless phones. Those bad boys can mess with your signal and slow things down. Remember, a clear line of sight from your router to your devices is the name of the game. So take a walk around your home, channel your inner interior designer, and find that sweet spot for your router. Next up, let's dive into the world of Wi-Fi channels. You see, your router communicates with your devices using specific channels, kind of like radio stations. But here's the catch. If you've got multiple networks crammed into the same space, they can interfere with each other, causing congestion and slower speeds. Think of it like a crowded party where everyone's trying to talk at the same time. It's chaotic, right? Well, that's what's happening with your Wi-Fi if you're on a crowded channel. The good news is that you can switch channels. Most routers have a setting that allows you to choose a different channel. Now, finding the perfect channel can be a bit of a trial and error process, but it's worth it. There are a few ways to find the best channel for your network. You can use a Wi-Fi analyzer app on your phone or computer. These apps scan the airwaves and show you which channels are the least congested. Experiment with different channels and see which one gives you the best performance. You might be surprised at the difference a simple channel change can make. Chapter 3. Firmware Updates – The Unsung Heroes of Wi-Fi Speed Okay, this next tip might sound a little technical, but trust me, it's a game changer. We're talking about updating your router's firmware. Now I know what you're thinking. Firmware? What in the world is that? Basically, firmware is the software that controls your router's hardware. It's like the operating system for your router. And just like you update your phone or computer software to get the latest features and bug fixes, you need to update your router's firmware to keep it running smoothly and securely. Router manufacturers are constantly working behind the scenes to improve performance, fix security vulnerabilities, and add new features. Firmware updates are how they deliver these improvements to your router. The process for updating your firmware varies depending on your router's brand and model, but it's usually pretty straightforward. You can typically find instructions on the manufacturer's website or in your router's manual. Chapter 4. Extending your reach Wi-Fi extenders and mesh networks. Alright, let's talk about those pesky dead zones in your home. You know, those areas where your Wi-Fi signal goes to die? We've all got them, especially in larger homes or homes with multiple floors. But fear not, my friends, because there are solutions. Two popular options are Wi-Fi extenders and mesh networks. Let's start with Wi-Fi extenders. As the name suggests, a Wi-Fi extender takes your existing Wi-Fi signal and rebroadcasts it, extending the range of your network. Think of it like a relay race for your Wi-Fi signal. Your router passes the baton to the extender, and the extender carries it further. Wi-Fi extenders are generally affordable and easy to set up. You simply plug them into an outlet in an area where your Wi-Fi signal is weak, and they'll amplify the signal, reaching those previously unreachable corners. Now, if you've got a larger home or a more complex layout, a mesh network might be a better option. 
Mesh networks consist of multiple nodes that work together to create a seamless Wi-Fi network throughout your home. Chapter 5. Lock it down, securing your network for speed and safety. We're reaching the finish line, folks, but this last tip is crucial. We're talking about securing your Wi-Fi network. Now, I know what you're thinking. Security? What does that have to do with speed? Well, a lot more than you might think. An unsecured network is an open invitation for anyone within range to hop on and start using your bandwidth. And trust me, you don't want your neighbors streaming 4K movies on your dime. Think of your Wi-Fi network like your home. You wouldn't leave your front door unlocked all day and night, would you? Well, your Wi-Fi network deserves the same level of protection. First and foremost, make sure you're using a strong password for your Wi-Fi network. And I'm not talking about password 123 here. Use a combination of uppercase and lowercase letters, numbers, and symbols. Next, enable WPA2 or WPA3 encryption on your router. This adds an extra layer of security, making it much harder for unauthorized users to access your network. And there you have it, folks. Five genius hacks to fix your slow Wi-Fi forever. We covered everything from router placement and channel optimization to firmware updates, Wi-Fi extenders, and network security. Remember, a fast and reliable Wi-Fi connection is essential in today's digital world. By implementing these tips, you'll be surfing, streaming, and gaming at warp speed in no time. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tips. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.